Alright guys, as you can see, I'm bringing back some childhood memories. I hope uh, the ones that are watching this video remember these games that we used to play back when we didn't have any smartphones or even phones for uh, for us to play with. So as you can see from the title of the video and from the content, today I will show you how to get these classic games on your phone and I hope you guys enjoy. Hey guys, I hope you're all doing well. So in today's video, I will be bringing back some classic games to your phone in a few easy steps uh, and all that it's take is going to be a couple of minutes from your time. Uh, without uh, further ado, I kind of wanted to ask you guys to subscribe to the channel if the video is helpful and don't forget to like as well. So with that being said, let's go ahead and start the tutorial. Now the steps are going to be shown to you on the right hand side of the screen. Uh, the steps are very easy. Everything that needs to be downloaded will be available in the description box. So the first thing you need to do is go to the Play Store and uh, search for break game if you cannot find that application on your play store just make sure to open the link from the description it will take you there and you can download it from there so let's wait for the application to start downloading after it's downloaded you're going to open the game and i'll show you how the settings work and how you will be able to switch between games and everything you pretty much need to know so now the game is downloaded i'll just quickly and easily click on open um, once you do that it will launch the application it might ask for some um, you know access just give it access if otherwise you should start doing uh, what you see here as well so there's 19 games in this application 19 classic games that all of us have played and if you haven't played them I, I think you should because these games are very classic and it just has a, a significant flavor to it if you know what I mean so uh, I'm gonna start off with the easiest one which is uh, trying to match these uh, icons uh, on the left hand or the you know the the below side of the screen I remember playing this game when uh, when I was a kid but the, the only downside is that the the buttons that you use to play with don't really have a clicky set otherwise it's really fun to play with it's almost like the device that we used to have when we were kids uh, now you can rotate the uh, the icons with the uh, buttons that you see in front of you as you would do in a normal uh, you know game break and otherwise it's really easy to use I'm gonna switch to another game and uh, I will show you I'll show you how that works as well it might show you an ad here and there uh, and you can just you know exit from it if you want otherwise just push on play and it will launch into the 19 applications you can uh, click on right and, or left to switch between games and uh, the one that you desire to play with you just press on start and it should start playing so as you can see there's a lot of games here uh, I remember some of them not all of them not gonna lie because I was not really into a lot of them um, but yeah this is uh, pretty much the one that I used to play with on a Sega as well uh, the ones with that looks like airplanes but not actually are airplanes they're supposed to be tanks <laughs> so yeah uh, that's pretty much it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope I brought back some good memories. If it did, make sure to like the video. If not, then, you know, just comment. Uh, if you're not liking the video, I'll be more than happy to reply and, you know, get your complaints into making my videos much better. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys next time.